Now tonight, talking more about weather. Sarah Canty joining us now to talk about what we can expect as we plan out our work week. What a surprise, some rain. Uh, That's no. what we're tracking towards the beginning of the week, but it's not going to be all bad. Actually, the end of the week is looking pretty nice, just cold. It's cloudy right now. Our live look from our camera on top of the BJCC. No rain in downtown for the time being, but that's going to change here. We have a few showers on the map right now, north of 2059 in Marion and Winston counties right now. Some moderate rainfall tracking through Haleyville and some light rain through Addison as well as Double Springs over towards Hackleburg as well. That's it as far as the rainfall goes for now, but that's going to change with all this wet weather back to our west. We have an approaching cold front and as this moves towards us, all this wet weather through Arkansas and Mississippi will arrive overnight tonight. So after around 10 o'clock, that's when the rainfall will really start to pick up. We'll see on and off showers throughout the day, heavy at times, mainly late afternoon into the evening, a few heavier pockets of rain. No widespread severe thunder or thunderstorms, or even definitely not severe, but not even expecting really thunderstorms with this. Just a good bit of rainfall that could total one to two inches. It clears out in time for Tuesday morning, and then Tuesday will be dry. Will be very mild as well on Tuesday. We're going to be in the low 60s, and then another possible round of rain on Wednesday, but that's looking pretty lacking, and only about a few isolated showers possible on Wednesday. Not going to add much to the rainfall totals. But for what we're going to see over the next 24 hours, we'll see one to two inches possible that we see a few higher totals than that, but really not expecting any major flooding concerns for tomorrow. But we're adding to an already a really extreme surplus of rain. We've had 20 inches of rain so far this year in Birmingham. And for February alone, we already have around 12 inches in Birmingham. Now the good news after this week, we're actually looking like we're going to be pretty dry towards the end of the month and to start out to March. So thankfully it does look like the pattern will be changing towards the end of the storm team seven day forecast with the beginning we'll be dealing with